Well, today we're up at we're up on Sherry Circle uh, here in Gallatin, uh, kind of in a little bit of the older area of town, and we're we're at a house or in a subdivision where uh, the ditch has started to cause some ditch bank erosion, and in that erosion, it's starting to threaten some of our utilities, some of our sanitary sewer, and the homeowner's yard. So we've come up with a, a solution uh, to stabilize the side of this larger ditch with gabion baskets which are a very interesting uh, product. They've been around a few years, uh, but we haven't used them a whole lot in Gallatin, and um, which hopefully we'd be using more of them. But they are like fence material you use to create a basket you fill with rocks. So it's a rock basket. And these rock baskets stack nicely uh, along the side of the ditch, just help stabilize that, that, that ditch bank and help hold it where it needs to be. And hopefully you can see in some of these pictures, uh, and we're also wrapping that up to the sanitary sewer line to help hold that sewer line uh, to keep the, the ditch intact and keep our utilities intact. So the corner of our yard, I noticed when we first got here, the, there was quite a bit of land around there. And it's over the years, just slowly, just slowly started eroding. My neighbor had, had some concerns about erosion too. So we you know, I called the city and they, and, uh, engineer came out and looked at it and we got, you know, got the ball rolling. Prior to using uh, ideas like the Gabion baskets, this would be a situation where we would have to excavate maybe up into the homeowner's yard and put a large riprap down. And that large riprap uh, will move over time and uh, work its way into the, street, into the ditch and, and it causes its own problems. By containing the rock inside a Gabion basket, it actually holds that bank together better. And so it's a more uh, efficient, better use of rock and time and materials that will stay in place longer.